Hi, it's Stella from Maple University, and this is Stella Short and Sweet for Liftoff from Z Man Games. It's 1950s. The race into space is on. Everyone's competing to better their equipment to launch their missions into space. The game plays 2 to 4 plays with mechanics such as card drafting, set collection, and engine building. The game is of medium complexity. In liftoff, players are drafting cards to get technology and resources to better equip their rocket, to launch many missions, and to get points. At the start of each round, specialist cards are drafted down to 3 to give you two options to upgrade or get money. This round or the next one. You then draw mission cards and choose one or more to keep depending on your technology level. One player at a time then launch their rocket, making sure they can pay and their weight is within the rocket capacity and get rewards like points, cash and more upgrade. Players can also collectively build space station, paying money but increase their income or getting technology card. At the end of 8 rounds, the player with the most points wins. Game is really tight. There are a few things that you need to balance and planning ahead. You need to make sure your rocket is upgraded to carry more weight in order to launch several missions. You gotta make sure the mission requirements are fulfilled and this takes a few turns usually to build up. You also get secret objective cards to earn more points or sell for cash if you just give up on them. I like the retro futuristic style of artwork like in Fallout games. And there's a rocket you can actually add parts to it, representing your upgrade for visual enjoyment, although you can track your upgrades on your board. One interactive element which I understand after playing it is the card draft. The first player that round can choose which direction drafting goes, which allows them to anticipate what cards they may receive by looking at other players' existing upgrades. So thanks for watching guys. If you have any questions for me, please write in the comment sections below. You would help us by subscribing to Meeple University and hit the bell so you won't miss anything from us. I also share my board games journey on Instagram, so hopefully I'll see you there too. Until next time.